are back! We're hungry! And today, we're standing at the wonderful Grand Anika Dam. Now this one, for those of you who didn't know, also called the Kalanai Dam, is the oldest dam in the world. It was made in the second century and the Chola Kings made it. And that's quite wonderful considering it's so old. I'm pretty damn impressed by how good you are with facts and stuff. This is one case though, where the journey has been as beautiful as the destination. Being the giant eaters that we are, all this fruit and natural food is not going to keep us going for very long. Mm. We're going to head out of here, head into Chennai, where we've been before. But once again, people have written to us and said, come back, there's lots more to eat. Grab the pineapples. I got the sugar cane. Don't leave your corn behind. The beautiful smooth silk highway number 45 and 45B which brought us here all the way from Madurai into noisy, chaotic, colourful, bright Chennai. We're in Teenagar right now in Pondi Bazaar. And this is where the action is. There are bright lights, people are out. And what really tells you you're in Chennai is that all the women have beautiful jasmine little rolls in their hair. We're looking for what Chennai has to offer in terms of food. We're looking for Brahmin food, we're looking for Chetanad food, and we're looking for a very, very special dosa that we're going to tell you more if we find it. And why are we back in Chennai? We got lots of mails from all of you wonderful fans. And so because you called us, we're back. Here's what you have to keep in mind. If you like this show and you want us to come visit your city, Send in your emails. Let us know where you'd like us to come. Even if we've been there before, we will be there. And we'll pick one lucky viewer to shoot the show with us and show us your city and your favorite eating places. So send in your entries to yummy at ntvgoodtimes.com and we'll pick one and we'll be there and we'll eat what you want to offer us. Pick me, pick me. Oh, I'm already on the show, sorry. But before we do that, there are some very important facts that we want to lay bare. Just so that you can get... No, 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 no. this is a family channel. Keep your clothes on. We are going to give you nothing but the bad truth. There is a whole lot of berry business going on over here. If you don't like any of this humor, you just have to grin and bear it. We are here to find out a very important thing. Which bear was it whose porridge was eaten by Goldilocks? Sir, can you give us a clue? He is being silent. He is not giving us the facts. But we will get to the bottom of this mystery, sir. Would you like to comment? This is becoming unbearable. This silence is killing me. If you come down here on this road, you will see bears lining all the cars. So if you come here and park your car, they're going to give you a 5 rupee ticket so that you can park here and they're going to put lots of bears on your car. The bears don't get charged anything though. A bit unfair against us humans. Barely had we begun that hunger is driving us onwards. He's talking about hunger, he's talking about hunger. This is unbearable. We're leaving, we're going to go eat. <laughs> Sir, are you sure you don't want to talk about Goldilocks? Oh, you beauty pie, you, I tell you. Oh, you're popsy.